medical school, veterinary school, dental school, grad school, or going into industry. In all those different paths, there are specific courses, for example, in medical school. Welcome back, everybody. It's your girl, Jackie Fai, and this is day 12 of my 90-day challenge, where for 90 days, I'm highlighting a college major, telling you what it's about, what courses to expect if you plan on taking this as a college major, and what are some of the career paths that you can get into with this major. Today, we're talking about human biology, so let's get started. Human biology is an interdisciplinary major that focuses on the study of human beings it includes learning about human genetic human physiology human biochemistry evolution of human beings and the ecosystem so ecology human biology is actually a great major if you're planning on going into fields like medicine veterinary medicine or any healthcare provider field Courses in this major lie heavily in the biology, as you can expect. However, you will have to take some courses in chemistry, physics, and math. As you get more advanced, biology courses become more advanced as well. So you will end up taking a lot of human biology classes, human anatomy, biochemistry, human genetics, cellular biology, molecular biology, organismal biology, general chemistry, and organic and organic chemistry. In addition to this classes you might also end up taking some courses in biomedical lab sciences working in a lab and learning how to handle human tissues like human cells or blood being an interdisciplinary major there is opportunities to concentrate in one of the areas in human biology for example at michigan state you can specialize in clinical immunology eukaryotic cell biology immunology or virology and if you're planning on going into med school, you could take the prerequisite courses such as human anatomy and biochemistry. In order to know what to specialize in and what courses to take, it is best to talk to your advisor to work out what courses work best with your interests and what you plan on going into, especially if you're trying to venture into medical school, veterinary school, dental school, grad school, or going into industry. In all those different paths, there are specific courses. For example, in medical school, you need to have some prerequisites before getting into medical school. And this is a conversation that you need to talk to your advisor about before taking any classes so that you don't waste money and you don't waste time. As I had mentioned, this is a gateway major into medical school, veterinary school, and most of grad graduate programs that deal with working with human tissue. So human biology really helps you get into this type of programs. However, you could also go into the industry where you could work as a research assistant, a lab technician, medical assistant, dental assistant. And these are gateways to getting into becoming a doctor, nurse, or any other uh, health professional. As always, if you found this video helpful, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And in the comment section, let me know what other major or course you want featured in the next video. I will see you all tomorrow as we discuss plant biology. So stay Stay tuned and I will see you all tomorrow. And I've been chilling, watching the ocean with you. Baby up with a slow motion crew. And we up in our growlings when people change, but not us. And we just chilling, kicking it, kissed by the sun. Could be soaked to the skin.